the blue-footed boobies dance. Please subscribe. So you don't miss a new story. In the heart of the Galapagos Islands, there lived a curious blue-footed booby named Bella. Bella was a young and energetic booby with strikingly blue feet that she was exceptionally proud of. She lived on a secluded beach, spending her days diving into the azure waters to catch fish and basking in the tropical sun. But Bella was not your typical booby, she had a passion for something far more unusual, she loved to dance. The Mocking Gulls Bella's dance continued to draw a crowd of curious onlookers, including the young boobies who admired her spirit. As she danced on the sandy shores, other blue-footed boobies started to join her in her rhythmic movements. Bella's unique choreography had inspired a dance revolution among her peers. They began to learn her intricate steps and adapted them into their own dances, adding their personal flair and creativity. This newfound enthusiasm for dancing brought a sense of unity and camaraderie among the boobies, who had previously been more reserved. However, Gilbert and his group of mocking gulls still found it amusing to taunt Bella. They had a tough time understanding how a booby, with such peculiar feet, could create something beautiful and unique. Their ridicule continued, but it no longer affected Bella. She had found a community of friends and fellow dancers who admired her for who she was. Bella's dance became a symbol of self-expression and the celebration of individuality. She danced with a freedom that inspired others to break free from the constraints of conformity. As time passed, the gulls began to notice the unity and happiness among the boobies. They realized that Bella's dance had a magical effect on her kind, and the gulls, too, began to experience a change of heart. Gilbert, who had once been the harshest critic, secretly practiced his own dance moves in the privacy of a hidden cove. His gull friends, intrigued by his sudden enthusiasm, joined him, and they formed their own unique dance troupe. In the end, Bella's dance had not only transformed the lives of the blue-footed boobies but also the hearts of the mocking gulls. The once hostile gulls came to appreciate the power of self-expression, unity, and the importance of embracing individuality. Bella's dance had created a ripple effect of positivity and acceptance that extended far beyond her own kind, reminding all creatures that beauty and meaning could be found in the most unexpected places. The Storm and Bella's Sacrifice As the storm raged on, the gulls sought refuge in the remnants of their damaged nests. They were hungry and desperate, unable to find any food in the tempestuous sea. After days of relentless rain and roaring winds, their desperation grew. Weak and exhausted, they realized that they had no choice but to swallow their pride and approach Bella, the skilled fisher. Bella, despite their past mockery, had a compassionate heart. She knew that in times of crisis, it was essential to set differences aside and come to the aid of those in need. Without hesitation, she agreed to help the gulls, offering her assistance in catching fish. She knew that her exceptional diving skills were their best chance for survival. Bella dove into the turbulent waters, her striking blue feet disappearing beneath the waves as she skillfully hunted for fish. She dived deeper and longer than ever before, determined to provide for the gulls in their time of need. Her webbed feet, which had been a source of ridicule, now became the lifeline for the hungry gulls. With great effort and perseverance, Bella managed to catch an impressive haul of fish, returning to the storm-battered gulls with her beak filled to the brim. The gulls gratefully accepted her offerings, and their hunger was finally quelled. They felt a deep sense of gratitude and remorse for their past behavior. The storm eventually subsided, and the gulls' nests were slowly rebuilt. During this time, they took the opportunity to apologize to Bella for their earlier mockery and express their heartfelt appreciation for her selfless act of kindness. Bella forgave them and reminded them that unity and understanding were far more valuable than holding grudges. Bella's sacrifice not only saved the gulls' lives but also taught them a valuable lesson in humility, compassion, and the power of unity. The entire avian community of the Galapagos Islands was deeply touched by Bella's actions. The experience made them realize that true strength was found in the willingness to help one another, regardless of their differences or past conflicts. This chapter of Bella's life became a testament to the transformative power of forgiveness and compassion, reinforcing the idea that every individual had a unique role to play in creating a harmonious world, no matter how unconventional their talents or attributes might seem. The Blue-Footed Boobies Legacy Bella's acts of kindness during the storm, coupled with her inspiring dance, had a profound and lasting impact on the Galapagos Islands. The gulls, having experienced Bella's generosity and forgiveness, adopted a newfound sense of unity and camaraderie among themselves. They joined Bella's daily dance sessions on the beach, creating a harmonious spectacle of diverse avian species dancing together. 
The beach, once a place of division and mockery, became a symbol of unity and celebration. Word of this heartwarming transformation soon spread throughout the Galapagos Islands. Birds of all kinds, from the frigate birds to the finches, gathered to watch and join in the spirited dances. The islands had never seen such a display of unity among its inhabitants. Bella's dance had become a unifying force, transcending species boundaries, and inspiring a sense of community that extended far beyond the shores of the Galapagos. As Bella continued to dance, she welcomed everyone who wanted to participate, emphasizing that everyone had something unique to offer. The islands became a haven for those who embraced their individuality and sought to share their talents without fear of ridicule or rejection. This harmonious environment led to a surge of creativity, cooperation, and a greater appreciation for the beauty of diversity. Years passed, and Bella grew older, her blue feet now adorned with a few gray feathers. She had fulfilled her purpose, leaving a legacy of unity and acceptance. Her story was shared far and wide, even reaching the human visitors who marveled at the Galapagos Islands' natural wonders. The tale of Bella, the blue-footed booby, served as a lasting metaphor for the world beyond the islands. It reminded everyone that celebrating our differences, embracing individuality, and extending kindness could bring about positive change, even in the face of adversity. Just as Bella's dance had transformed a community of mocking gulls into a supportive and united group, it showed the world that it was never too late to change, to forgive, and to build bridges. Bella's legacy became a symbol of hope, illustrating that no matter how unique our qualities and talents, we all have a vital role to play in creating a better, more inclusive world. In the end, the blue-footed boobies dance became a universal message of unity, diversity, and the profound impact of one individual's determination to make a difference. The end. Don't forget to subscribe, 